hi guys hi guys hello everyone welcome back to my channel welcome back to yet another video thank you so much for joining me i for coming i got to subscribe like the video and share you guys now guys let's just talk about it bbm zansi now we are going to talk about these guys upravo pino makeko who are in hot water over their comments you guys when it comes to upik brother mzansi which is the show that i only watch sometimes because i'm not gonna sit here and lie i only watch this sometimes not really uh every time but now because uh, these guys have been trending uh one of them has been uh, uh, uh disqualified something like that and another one issued a warning because of their sexual comments you guys are uh, when they were talking there about uh doing other things when it comes to another game now barely a week since the start of the big brother mzan siya moshe there is an already drama on the show now besides the big step in kid fights and sexual tension between our housemates viewers have since shown their concerns after two male contestants oh my keke uh, uh, the real name is utsepo tau and oh bravo b who is olindo kuhle nsele now um made what has been described as inappropriate sexual comments about the female contestants now in the early hours of this morning while contestants were seemingly under the influence of alcohol Omar Kek and Opravo B were discussing the female contestants now uh, I'm not gonna say those way that they were saying let us just um her first and then she is drunk let us do her tonight she is drunk they said and say to i was planning uh, that they let me uh smash this is this is just like the um, you know that kind of conversation i'm not really comfortable with it. just to test you to satisfy me right that's their conversation they're wanting to do whatever to to the ladies uh just to satisfy themselves so something something like that you guys those really sexual comments you know what i mean and now the producer producers of a big brother Mzansi have since commented uh are saying they are aware of the incident and investigating the matter now we are aware of the incident that transpired in the early hours of this morning in the big brother Mzansi house we are currently investigating the matter and will provide the update in due course now viewers have weighed in on the matter saying there's a video of them literally saying they want to and i've watched that video you guys they want to sexually not don't own a drunk letter what is there to investigate one viewer said now evict them together with those two ladies that were discussing a menace and don't don't right now just evict all four of them uh big brother needs to disqualify umar cake and no bravo b we can't have two grown men in the house who are plotting against a lady those comments were just so snacks for me, you guys. Like a few years ago, Big Brother Mzansi was marred by a sexual uh, assault case. Now, one of the contestants was evicted from the house after he was seen inappropriately touching a female contestant while in his sleep. Now, footage of the incident went viral on social media but was later blocked after being deemed inappropriate and violating the nudity of uh, the sexual uh, uh, policy, something like that, you guys. You know, like their comments are so disgusting. Like I was watching that video, I did not know you guys, but a good you are uh, Omar K. No Bravo B. Uh, they have been uh, disqualified. Who has been disqualified? Oh, Bravo B. Something like that. Bravo B disqualified from Big Brother Mzansa. I mean, good riddance. Come on, man. You know what? I do not know. What, what, what would you say that? The fact that he's saying she is drunk, right? So if she's drunk, then you want to take your chances. What nonsense is that? Now, Big, big Brother Mzansi, uh, guys, I have a problem pronouncing everything with an R. I'm sure you've realized that all the ways with R, I honestly struggle up pronouncing them. So please get used to me. Now, Big Brother Mzansi season 4 contested Uli Ndogut and Sele, uh, known as Bravo B, has been disqualified from the 24-7 reality show. The decision to disqualify U Bravo B comes after social media users circulated a video of U Bra Bravo B and Utsepo Tau, also known as Uma Keke, talking about how they need to F uh, either Uliema or Uzi because they are all drunk. You know what I mean? I was planning that girl who can uh, let me don't don't uh, is me my home girl just to satisfy myself. Just imagine, you guys. So now Friday morning, the production team said they were investigating the matter, and our uh, father will make a decision. So you are aware of the incident. This is what they said, you guys. And 
are following threats from one of their fans to report the show to the BP, uh, to the BCCA, sorry, the Broadcasting Complaints Commission of South Africa. Others took social media to beg the show's production team to evict the two participants. Now, multi chose in a statement on Friday evening, they say they have investigated the matter regarding a conversation between two housemates on Big Brother Mzans, which is currently airing on DSTV Channel 198. We do not condone any acts. Um, that threaten the safety of the housemates on the show and we take gender-based violence seriously. The housemate uh, that initiated and drove the conversation, Oprah B has been disqualified from the game and the other housemate, Umar Keke, will face a reprimand from Big Brother with a social lesson on the behavior etiquette. Now, Mzansi Magic will ensure that Umar Keke is coached to call out anyone who speaks or behaves in a derogatory manner now you guys uh i watched that video as as well when uh, he was told that um he can just move away okay i do not know you guys uh people were just discussing that on twitter let me just uh I'll go there and see you guys and guys I, I do not know if i can bring the video uh People are just uh, uh, spreading that video, you guys, of Umar Keke, the conversation between Umar Keke and no, no Bravo B. Now, we will make sure that Umar Keke takes this $2 million for our boy, Bravo, that is a fan, uh, somewhere there, you guys. And then, let me scroll a little bit. Umar Keke must just leave the Pipim Zanzi house. Nobody's going to vote for him anymore. He messed up. This is someone, you guys. Now, let this be a lesson for all men who think uh, casually talking about sleeping with women without their consent is a joke. Just behave and keep it in your pants. <laughs> that was someone. Imagine the fact that they were saying because she is drunk. You know what I mean? Uh, oh, film Peloti Haibo, guys, listen again. I get liking someone and being a fan, but let us not uh, distort the reality. Bravo B and Makeke are talking about ESX not uh, effing uh, what what he clearly illuminates it at the end by using the word smash we all know that smash means yeah but it's so bad the conversation was just so bad i mean honestly speaking the fact that they mentioned good i wanna do it because she's drunk you know what i mean it's so wrong I don't know. Shout out uh, to Umish uh, for showing some kindness to Umar Keke. It's going to take time for the rest of the housemen to trust him or to become comfortable around him, which is true, you guys. Umish did well, okay? Now, Angaz, you guys, the conversation was just so nasty. Umar Keke apologizes to his fellow housemates for everything. Yeah, he did apologize, but after all that, you know what? Something like that would come to me. Maybe some timber now. My cake and bravo be a kind of giving me timber and casual vibes. I think I'm gonna enjoy them, okay. Now ELS in tears because of what Bravo B and Makeke said. Share man. Uh, so all these fan bases of this season are nation, e.g. PP Nation, Makeke. Yo, you guys like it's a whole lot. Makeke and Bravo made the evil spirit that came between Temba and Geshua. Stay away from my season four Popeye and Spinach characters. <laughs> you guys, Bravo B has just been disqualified from the Big Brother house. Makeke has been issued with a double strike for their plotting to say sexually assault Uliema last night. Yeah, man, you guys, I did watch the video, so that was just so wrong, hey? That's just so wrong, man. Why would you do that when I take advantage of someone who's under the influence of alcohol or drunk? You even say, okay, let us do it because she's drunk. It, it, it's just, it was just some behavior. For me, Jay, good readings when it comes to, you know what, what I mean. But anyways, you guys, your thoughts on the conversation, uh, Bravo B has been disqualified with Uma Keke, uh, issued with a double strike, something like that. Uh, let us just uh, end this video now before it's too long. Your thoughts on the comment section, like the video, subscribe, then I'll meet you again on the next video.